Hey guys, it's Lava Dude, and today we're going to be looking at the new Heroes of Gujitsu DC Comics Wave. And this is kind of crazy, I was not at all expecting this. We had the Marvel Wave, of course I will link that video in the description or in the cards, whatever. It's going to be there somewhere. Wow, there was a voice crack in a half. But basically, these guys are really cool, and they just came out, new releases. We don't have the full wave, of course there is. Mr. Superman right here, but I didn't really like the look of him. I thought Flash and Batman were way cooler. So getting into the packaging for these guys, as you can see, we have a front viewing window of the figures. It says they contain the goo filling. He's super gooey. He's super squishy. And we're going to have to see how those compare. And then on the back, as you can see, we have images, and it gives you little promos of them. As always, you can pause the video and read those for yourself. And then moving on, of course, they just show the whole wave. So let's get into this. Let's open these guys up and see what they have to offer. All right, so we're going to kick this off by looking at the Dark Knight himself, Batman. This guy looks super awesome. As you can see in the background, we have the older guys, the Marvel dudes. We have Iron Man, Captain America, and Spider-Man. So here is Mr. Batman himself. This is obviously a more recent Batman design. Of course, when you're getting these guys, you really want to make sure you don't get stuff all over them because it is going to completely stick to the figure. Like, I just took them out of the packaging, and there's already some stuff like crumbs and all on him but looking at him he looks really awesome there's a lot of cool detail going on here you got this black all over him and this belt that is really nice that's a mold of course the heads are molded on to keep them inside now this is where stuff gets cool because his cape actually is a different piece of plastic it's not squishy it's but it's not this hard it's weird it's like a happy medium between the two but looking at him here he is a squishy, he is the same as Spider-Man over here, as you can see he's very squishy, but Batman is the exact same, same kind of texture and everything, and then when you squish him, as you can see there's little mini bats in here, which is really cool, that is a super cool figure, moving on, we have the Flash, and the Flash is definitely one of my favorite DC characters in general, so seeing this is really awesome, he definitely has like less details but he still looks like the flash like you can tell this is the flash as you can see we have this molded on belt we have these yellow boots right here he's in this running position which i thought was really cool on the face you can see he's got all the sculpting going on there and obviously he doesn't have that rubber piece like batman because he's not the same kind of character but looking at his as you can see he is a gooey character so he's exactly like iron man where they're kind of more mushy and stuff so as you can see when you squeeze him you can see these little lightning bolts right there, and that is really cool. He is filled with those. So I think out of these two, the better one is definitely Flash, just because I like the character more. But if I think you're going off of like how the figure looks, I would choose Batman. He looks really awesome in this character mold. But I hope you guys did enjoy this video. If you did, leave a like. And of course, if you haven't already and you want to see more of this, subscribe, and I'll see you guys in the next one.